Once the project is created, it will open automatically. The project sidebar contains important info at a glance, including the main contract for the project and client profile. This area is kind of like a cheat sheet or quick reference. In the top left, you can edit the project title by clicking on it, or give the project a date by clicking Set Date. The tabs across the top are all the different ways you can communicate with your client. First is the Emails tab, where you can draft a new email to your client and see all of the past emails that have been sent out from the project in Dubsado. The Invoices tab is where you'll create and manage invoices. The Forms tab is where you can add and send forms. The Appointments tab allows you to send scheduling invites, and the Workflows tab is where you'll manage automation on the project. We will be covering all of these topics in more detail in later lessons. The Task tab lets you add a task associated with this project. If you set a due date on the task, it will show up on your Dubsado calendar. The Notes tab is great for capturing notes. You can add a plain note or a call log, where you can set a date and time. Last but not least, the Activity Log, which will show a record of actions taken within this project. Tasks and notes are just for you and are not visible to your client. On the project sidebar, you can track project tags and the project status for greater organization. Tags are like hashtags that you can use to label and categorize projects with a common trait. You can add or remove a tag at any time within the project. The project status indicates the current phase or milestone. When your project progresses from one stage to the next, like converting from a lead project to a job project, you can manually update the status inside the project. Once you finish the job or if a lead goes cold, you can archive the project so it's tucked away in a different area of your account. You can always unarchive it later if needed. Tip number one When in doubt, it's better to archive a project instead of deleting it. That way, you can go back to the information in the future but still keep your main projects page uncluttered. Tip number two Archiving a lead project will remove any invoices. This is meant to prevent unpaid balances from piling up. All other information will be saved should you wish to unarchive the project in the future.